I realized this computer will not turn on. And after removing the back lines, I removed the back cover because it has an internal battery. So I removed this back cover. And then I found out, yeah, I use these screw drivers. I just use the flat head to help me easily detach the back cover from the computer. Now, this is the battery and this is the RAM. So the computer that will not start has two issues. Either the, in, the battery is not good if the battery is no good, you can probably still start the computer with the charger. And if this is the charging port right here, and if the charger happens to be good, it's going to be okay. But most of the time, the issue is having to do with the RAM. This is basically because the computer was going through some updates and my wife didn't allow the update to be completed before she basically, you know, closed the computer. You know, how you close the computer and put it in your bag and you shut everything down. It can go to sleep, but for a prolonged time or period of time, whenever you try to restart the computer back again because it didn't complete the updates, it means that the RAM is not gonna basically have to be cleared so you gotta have to take away the ram so this is the ram right here the ram is the random access memory of the computer so i remove the battery it didn't fix the problem and i went ahead and remove the ram and now the update is going on so now it's 10 percent update what I am doing right now is I'm basically going to wait for the update to complete up to 100%. And then I will restart the computer to get a fresh start. And then after that, I can go ahead and put all of this back together. And I will put the screws and everything. So that is what it is. Doing this right in my room right now. Enunti.